A Croatian friend of mine introduced me to this delicious stuffing, not only for chicken but also for veggies if you want to make this 100% vegetarian. And what makes it so special is this vegetable stock. It's full of real vegetables, it's got spices in it and it has enough seasoning in it so you don't need to add any more salt. So I'm going to add a tablespoon of the vegetable stock into some onions and in this onion I've added a lot of butter. So there's about 25 grams of butter. We want it to bubble away because this needs to absorb our fresh breadcrumbs at the end. So just let that cook off for a moment. And some nuts for some texture. Now this is a combination of hazelnuts, walnuts, there are almonds in there and also Brazil nuts but you can use whatever you like. We'll sprinkle them in and now I'll turn the heat off. So all of that butter is going to absorb these fresh breadcrumbs. And when I say fresh breadcrumbs, I mean a sourdough loaf that's maybe one to two days old. Cut off the crust and then just blend it up until you've got this fluffy consistency. So we'll add a few generous handfuls into our butter, onion and stock mixture. Coat that well and you can see how it absorbs all of that delicious butter. Now I'm going to add some more. And we just want this to be crumbly in texture, just like that. Great. I'll add the zest of one lemon, because I love the freshness of it, particularly in stuffings. Now, if you're using this stuffing for some vegetables and you want to keep it 100% vegetarian, I like to add some cheese. So I'm using some cacciotta, but you could use some mozzarella, parmesan, whatever cheese you have in the house. This cheese is pretty delicious and you'll see it cuts just like butter. It's so soft. So I'm gonna cut that into cubes and once the stuffing is cool, then add the cheese and it's ready to stuff any type of vegetable you like, just like this capsicum. It's fantastic with zucchini or even eggplant.